the fairy tale manga had been announced to be coming to an end. And I wanted to give my thoughts on it. Now, I will say this right now. I stuck with fairy tale for a pretty long damn time. I stuck through fairy tale through the Grand Magic game. I stuck through that series until not do One Punch of the God of War, I think. I was already starting to lose interest in the series. And I just, I fell off, and I was just, I had no interest in watching it at that point. But, uh, it's been running since 2006 to the present day. It's currently 2017, February 25th, as of the recording of this video. And it was created by Hiro Mashima, the creator of Brave Master. And it is a good series. And something has been bothering me recently is all the hate it's been getting. Yes, there is a lot of problems. It's a really bad series. But I remember when I experienced the first manga that I've been reading for a long time ending. That was Naruto a couple of years ago. I got into anime through Dragon Ball around age like 10. And Naruto ended. I got into Naruto in like 2013, so it wasn't 2012, it wasn't that bad for me. But it was still a part of my weekly routine. And it was something that I had a very good time doing every day. I remember I was in school and I would like get my phone out walking between classes or I would lie and say I to do the bathroom just so I could read the Naruto chapter. This was before I got into One Piece. But I remember when I found that it was ending, I would see comments on the internet. Thank God the shitty show. And I'd always be like, dude, really? And you really it's like, it's like, it's just, it's just, I don't like fairy tale, but there's no reason for the fans, or you guys and other people to go around and say fairy tale is bad. Alright? Fairy tale is bad, that's your opinion, good for you. But we need to consider the fairy tale fans. The series that they really enjoy that some of these people could have been reading. Fairy tale has been going on for 11 years now. So somebody, so imagine the guys that have been reading since like 2006, 2008, 2007. No people have been reading for almost 11 years. And to them, this is a big deal. Is it going to be something they can't get up every week and read? I don't know what day Fairy Tale Chapter come out. I honestly don't know. <laughs> they, like, I, I, Mondays, I think. Tell me in the comments. When do a Fairy Tale Chapter come out? By the way, I knew it. I may even knew it. I may even do a reaction to the last couple chapters. Like I did with Bleach. Like, I won't, you know, read it. But I'll invest myself in the ending. Just because I am, I will admit, curious to how this is going to end. I'm... Not exactly how the story will end. I only couldn't care less about like Zara, yeah, like what Zara and the experienced Natsu drag is. I couldn't care less. But there are things like the pairings. I'm interested in who ends up with who. I'm just, I'm just genuinely curious. I'm curious to how all that stuff happened. I'm curious to the full story with the dragon. Like it, when we get that in for like a flashback on that, I'll probably read that. And there are questions that I like. There were a few, a couple of things about the theory that interest me while reading it, and I still have enough curiosity about those things left to go back and read the ending. Like I'm not saying fairy tale good. I'm not. It's it's terrible. I'm I'm not, I'm not saying it's any less of a, of a piece. It, it, it's anything less than a piece of porn. No, it is. Borderline hardcore porn. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to debate that. But the point is that a lot of people love reading fairy tale. And fairy tale is ending. And while I am very happy, somewhat, because I'm just like, you know what, thank God this story finally ending. Though there will be no more bullshit. Like all the people, I oh, mean, you, you're gonna annoy me. When I have to look at all these people around, they I was such a fucking bullshit. Oh. The earth that kind of made it like, ah, ah, but la, 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 I'm like, dude, dude, like, shut up, I don't care, this is nothing new. I go for Neverworld, and Jane and they all make videos of how Urza cuts the meteor, I'm like, why are you even angry? Why do you even care at this point? It's fairy tale. Like, you did not that's the shitty writing. 
<laughs> I mean, it's fairy tale. And, and then when there's like, and then like when there's a thing where like Lucy tits are visible to the whole world to see. People get, people are like, dude, focus on the fighting and the plot. We don't want to see Lucy boobs right now. We want to know how this fight will end. We want this. We want that. Lucy boobs are nice. Save them for when you're not in the middle of something important and ruining a good scene. And then it, I'm like, you know what? I'm kind of happy at the ending, so I don't need to put up with that. But you know what? I also think Fairy Tale's gone on long enough. I think it's reaching that okay, like spin off the one thing, like Naruto. Like with Naruto, they have Boruto. I'm like fine. Once a month, Boruto to catch are fine. But there is a line where a weekly series hits the limit. Um, the only reason I can play about that with One Piece is because I think Oda's still writing. There is no difference in the quality. If I would actually be willing to say One Piece had gotten better in some ways since it started, but Fairy Tale hasn't. I actually, I I can I could still go back and rewatch the first like two arcs of Fairy Tale and actually somewhat enjoy it. Fairy Tale was a, was actually pretty damn good in the beginning. And I feel like it would be remembered as a really good series and it had ended after the, like, the Phantom arc. The arc where Lucy's father paid the other guild to capture her. I feel like that was like... That was where it went from like, good. The Tower of Heaven arc, but then the Phantom Blade, the Phantom arc, the Phantom Blade arc I think it's called. It got really bad. And I feel like it then ended there and we remembered as something good. And I just feel... It's the best thing for the fairy tale at this point. Not just, not just, not because I hate it. I'm being unbiased here when I say I thought the best thing for the series is for it to end. I feel like it, it's only going to start getting worse, and I feel like it's hit the point where the author is declining in his storytelling. Just like Naruto, I will, I would. I'll get. Okay, I'll admit it. I would like it if Naruto continued. I will admit to that, Naruto. Okay, no, One Piece is my favorite theory, Naruto is my fanboy theory. You know how a lot of people say like Dragon Ball the anime they fanboy over? Naruto the anime, while I know I can be critical of it, and I can critique it, it is the anime I have like nostalgia for. Meaning, so, like, the first anime I watched besides Dragon Ball, the first day it really got me involved in the community. And so I, that, that's the anime I'm like, I always do miss reading. But, or watching, the point is, okay, on with the point, is that I feel like Fairy Tales at the same point Naruto is at, at the end of the war. Which is, it needs to end, and just because I feel like otherwise, fa otherwise the true fans, the one, the one, the fans that don't give a shit, where Oda cuts them, where Oda. Yeah, and you know, Oda cuts Meteor in half. Yeah, he cuts Meteor in half. Yeah, he no, when Urza cut the meteor, like, when that kind of stuff happens, no people don't care, but they're gonna hit a line. There's a line, like, you know, there's a line for everybody. My line in Naruto was it the fourth grade ninja war. My line with our, I would say my line was like, the Naruto and Sasuke fight, like, around that area. Like, the point I'm making is that, Nar that, Look at unscripted, by the way. This is just me talking about the end of fairy tale. But yeah, so fairy tale ending. Those are my thoughts. This is me talking about fairy tale ending. Really, hope you guys enjoyed. I may cover the last. I'll, do, I'll probably do what I did with Bleach. Like when it's announced, five more chapters, ten more chapters. I'll just, um, I'll jump into it. The difference is, with Bleach, I was caught up to the manga. Like, with Bleach, I was caught up. Like, I had genuine, genuine interest to read Bleach every single week. I have no desire to keep up with Fairy Tail and, like, read it every week. But I do have a desire to read the last couple chapters, just out of sheer curiosity. So I'll probably read them and review them, just, just because. Like, what would I lose from reading or reviewing it? I hope you guys enjoyed this fairy tale video. You won't be seeing one of these again until the end of the series is announced. And that's only if I feel like it. If the end of the series is announced, it's 
Yeah, it's announced in June, and I'm in the middle of final. I may turn around and say, you know what, I don't give a crap. Screw it. I'm not doing this. If it's announced, if it's announced while I'm busy, I may turn around and say, screw it, but whatever. Hope you guys enjoy. What are your opinions on fairy tale ending? Like, what are your opinions on it, honestly? And don't just say, yay, the shit at a shitty manga ending. No, like, what is your, like, give me an actual opinion here, guys. I'm very curious. It, I've seen a lot of basic ass, lame ass. Oh no, fairy tale ending. I love fairy tale works. Thank God, but now I'll need to see the stupid shitty character of not do anymore. But yeah. Hope you enjoyed, like the videos you did. If you want to see other videos like this, surprise, I cover I'll co I cover other things. One Piece, Naruto. I do a theory review, like I have I plan on doing a Sword Art Online review with Avatar the Last Airbender review. Got a lot of great stuff coming. Hope you enjoyed. Have a great day. Check out my Facebook and my Twitter, which are up in the description box down below.